What's up, everybody? This is the Poker Coaching Study Session, and today we're looking at a bubble spot, button versus big blind. So how do we play from the big blind? How does, actually, we're looking at how do we change our strategy when we're on the bubble, when we're playing the big blind? Let's get started. You want to call this the gut shot. A lower, no, it's not even a gut shot. It's like... We're 20 big deep, are we? 20 big blinds deep, yeah, against the button. Yeah, it's, mm -hmm. a gotcha. it's actually a gut shot. I don't well, think so. Well, I, 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 again... Well, it's both okay. ends, right? You could get 9-10, you could get a 5. That's right, double gutter. I mean, 9 tens is a better shirt on board. Yeah. Nine ten also hits more of his range, right? So that's right. Better straight on board. How did Mario, you uh, the, the seam adjusted? Uh, I see him. How how you managed to do this? Yeah. So what I did was uh, so I added an ICM structure, and then there's uh, seventeen paid, eighteen players left. So very high ICM. With like short stacks, there's four big blinds, uh, five big blinds. We're middle stack with 20 big blind. We're facing a middle stack. And then they're shorter stack than us. And then same as us, chip leader, second, third, and then yeah. Well, that's cool. So I basically we ran a bunch of sims and then we can compare them to the actual chip EV to see how it changes. Awesome. So. I think I would fault the gutter. I say I'm wise. I'm folding here every time. Yeah. All right, it's always a fault. And then uh, let's look at this. Nine and 10 beats already. That's pretty. That's what I was thinking. Like, if you, if you are, straights. you'll be already dead. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Interesting blast. Ten four suited. Yeah. Nine four suited. So first thing of notice is that the villain is betting pretty big here, so he is not using the small size very much. Yeah, because of the board, I suppose, kind of, to you know. Yeah, he's sizing up a lot on this kind of board, even though we're an ICM. So say he bets 36. Uh, this is going to be our strategy against a bigger bet. Mm -hmm. So not much raising. And then if we compare... Here and then the board is Jack K eight seven. So a chip EV chip EV first off. So it's funny here because ICM is gonna use bigger sizes than chip EV. Hmm. So this is the chip EV uh, without ICM, basically on the right. And it's using the small size a lot. Sometimes the big size, it's mixing, right? But when it comes to ICM, it really sizes up, doesn't use the small size anymore. That can 10% less, so. Well, where on these charts does it say, where does it say whose range it is on these charts? Because I, I look at them and I, Okay, yeah. well, it's simple. Okay, it's yeah. you need to follow the stories here. Okay, yeah, so the rule, and then the first player to act is the big blind. So that's the big blind strategy, and he checks. So after he checks, this is in position. So that's the button, that's his strategy. The same okay. goes here. All right. All right. So, 
again, we're not using ICM adjusted ranges, right? No, we're not. As you like to mention every time we do that. I just wanted to double check. I got here late. Uh, this is well, uh, given well. you are the one who's supposed to give me the ICM range. I don't know why you keep you asking. Tell me what to run. <laughs> Plus, you have GTO Wizard ICM. You can get ranges from that. <laughs> yeah. So, on the right side, this is a GPV solution. So, we can already see that at GPV, uh, we raise all in sometimes. We have, we, we raise, uh, we don't always raise small. Whereas, raising all in here uh, on ICM is a lot more rare. Also, notice how we don't raise top pair at ICM, right? Jack 10 is not even raising all the time, okay? Chippy V, you're supposed to be raising Jack 10 every time you have it, right? You're supposed to be digging in your jacks to be raising because you're 20 big blanks deep, it's top pair, blah, blah, blah. ICM, top pair, you're just calling. Okay. Progress. You need like a two pair to be raising or like some uh, pretty strong hand, like top pair and a draw. Hmm. And then you don't raise big very often anymore. So already like we can see like our range with top pair shifts a lot from this section. We go from raising top pair a lot to just raising two pair. What's a 10-4 here? It's like just a pure draw. I wonder why it's picking 9-6 to go nuts in ICM. Yeah. Well, it's a popular combo in both scenarios, right? Yeah. <laughs> really difficult to play when we're on the turn and uh let's say a 10 comes or a queen comes or an ace comes yeah uh we're a little bit in the dark there mm -hmm. or okay. i'm just the only one god we can call jack 10 and the ace comes and then, then you reevaluate re whereas uh, if you raise it and the ace comes anyway you're like oh you know mm -hmm. okay Okay, Jack A deuce. Well, not a great hand to start with. Probably just gonna fold. But now let's think about. So you gotta call every deuce here. Mm -hmm. I'm not okay. sure if we fold even the highest uh, pair with the low bad kickers. You're against the button. But we are against ICM also. I agree with Maxi. I think the deuce will not call. I don't think you can fold the deuce here. King deuce, queen deuce has to call, right? Every ah. deuce in our range has to call mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. uh, look, I don't know. So this Maybe. one folds. And then let's see. Okay, so pair of deuces are calling. Okay. We only raise eight percent of the time. Let's give it a quick compare with the other solution. So Jack, a deuce. All right. So let's see the betting strategy for in position. Hmm. So uh, once again, it bets more often at ICM than it bets at GPV. So it must be in function of the button, but the button seems to be betting more often for that from the two samples we've seen. All right, so we bet, and then 
GPV is raising a lot. Look at this, 21% raise versus 8% raise at, at ICM. The kind of hand we're going to want to raise at GPV up there. All of our jacks are raising, whereas here our jacks are super resilient. Right? We don't raise much jacks. And juices are calling everywhere. GPV, I say. It doesn't. Yeah. When well, ICM two pair is just calling. And then GPV two pair is raising. I know. You mean, you mean the jack eight? The deuce eight. Oh, the deuce eight. And the, and the jack deuce. Yeah. Two pair, right? Yeah. That's because you, you get to protect your range less at ICM. You just play more aggressive with strong hands. Right. I don't know why it likes 5-4 here. Anyone knows? It really likes 5-4, both at GPV and ICM. I don't have much 5-4s here. What, what suits? Everything but clubs. Yeah, there's that's the back door to the to the straight. I'm not right. Yeah, it it's back it's Old blocks. double back door straight draw. The five four connects with the eight and the two and the back door flush draws. Yeah, that's a far fetched back door straight or back door flush, right? Plus it probably doesn't block any of his value or any of his folding range. And then what, what's up with these? Hello. Oh, oh what's up, Yas? How's it going? Yeah, good. I think I, I drop him for. So, for those that missed the beginning, I, I reran some sins uh, with this structure, basically. So, it's the stone bubble. We got 17 paid and 18 players left. This is ch uh, stack distribution. We got some four big blind, five big blind. Then we have 20 big blinds here. And yeah, lots of lower stacks. Stack. And then, yeah, there's some other middle stacks. And then there's some big one. Like it's a very, it should be like a really, really high risk uh, premium for us. So, and then we compare. Uh, this one on the left is the solution with the ICM payout. And then on the right, the GPV. And then we see, like, for example, a Jack 7 is always raising at GPV. But at ICM, it's never raising. Yeah, if you see the amount of raises uh, for GPV versus uh, at yeah. yeah, it's uh, we're raising three times more often at GPV. Yeah. So a lot more calling. All right. It's a new one. 10, 10, 10 4, 4. Oh. We got a semi good blocker hand, do we not? Yeah. It checks that. Yeah. Fault, nothing good. Yeah. <laughs> That's just what it's going to be. Seven of space is not that important. Bold. Okay, do you call with the hand like six, seven of hearts? No. You know what I am? No. Maybe yeah, better see. raise and chip away this hand. I wonder if you call with uh, uh, a nine deuce or something like that. <laughs> yeah, you call every deuce here. So, six, seven of heart is raising, not really call. No falling. Never would find those raises. Uh, it's funny because at Chip EV it's pure folding. Yeah. So it's uh, very marginal, it's just uh, 
Yeah. You have to find some. You call a king eye here. Love what about king queen? Well, we can see this one in spade, for example. Are we covered or is he covering us, actually? Even stack. Even stack, okay. Uh, Did you ask if we had spades? Yeah, if we have king nine of spades. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You want to call with king nine of spades? Yeah, yeah. If king nine of spades, I would. Yeah. What? Why is the Grace, but uh, at least not fault. Sorry, Joey. I I was doing something else and on the side and not really paying attention, but why is the pot so large? It's not. What? It's half it's half measures, like so nineteen. It's not like, big lines, he said chips. Yeah, it's chip. Well, it's not even that. It's like he did it so one uh eighteen is one point eight, Joey. So a king nine of spade has to continue. Divided yeah. by ten. <clears throat> yeah, divided by ten. That's thank you. King Queen. Okay. They also have a backdoor good shot and backdoor good shot, backdoor straight on and off card. Okay. Love this spot. Well, we need to call. Oh, okay, so the big blind is ten here, ten dollars. It's about nine point six chips. Yeah. Okay. Well. So. We call every five here. Every, yeah. every five, we call this five also. I'm yeah. not happy to do it, but yeah, I think we have yeah, some previous examples. <laughs> With the flush draw and the straight draw and everything, everything that's around. Do but we, we have every, to. Do we, we don't call every have five on a jack 10 board? No, we don't, but the opponent could have. Yeah, you can have anything. I mean, yeah. Yeah. So but he's he's not betting big on this board. It's funny because on jack eight, X, he was betting big. On Jack ten five, it doesn't bet that big. Hmm. Like he just bets pink, eighteen, and then he goes all in. Oh my goodness! Yeah, you see that sometimes. Huh? If uh... yeah, that's the thing you see at GBV. I don't see any value. I just ace Jack. Everything else is. Got two different boards. Oh, no. okay. okay. king. You get hurt when you do that kind of shenanigans. All right. Yep. Can basically put a lot of pressure on uh, any 10, for instance. Oh, it's funny. It doesn't do that at GPV at all. No, of course not. Yeah. There's no, there's not as much pressure on GPV. Then why does it want to go with like ace four off? Because you have to have bluffs, and uh, this is uh, off of the back door. Double cutter. <laughs> yeah, that's ambitious. I'm I'm never finding that yeah, personally. Yeah, ace, probably yeah. ace of spades or the four of spades that uh, does it. All right, all right. When we face a bet now, we call every five. I see it. Yeah, he's when they have a range bet, I think we have to call all the bottom. Yeah. Especially I get, think we Yeah. I'd be interested to see if we start folding bottom pair when he starts having polarized bets. Or a polarized range where he does a lot of checking. So another texture basically. Or maybe against this, right? Say yeah, the card down set on you. What do you do with like a ten? Fold. And fold your tens, Josh? Yeah, if it depends on maybe what then it is. Two space, of course not. Uh, Ace 10, I don't know. Against population? Yes. Against Louis, absolutely not. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fold everything I versus Louis. Any ten. <laughs> no, Ace, Ace I versus some of the jacks. You're not going to be printing with your tens there when it does. Yeah, if you have space, I would call them even. Well, the Jack Nine folding. I don't think I'd fold that ever in game. Can't <laughs> buy that. all in in this situation. Yeah, he bets. Run the bubble, right? 
Yeah, I'm the bubble indeed, so. Like you're gonna make money if you fold. And there are four big blind stacks and three big blind stacks. Fold, man. Here's your money. Yeah. That's what it is. Band was the stack uh, just. I agree, it's hard to do, but uh, still. Uh oh. Uh, we're out, right? Okay. Stories. Well. Oh no. I reckon, uh, what? Wow, that's interesting. It doesn't like checking. It wants you to raise here. Wow. No, it wants you to bluff. Okay, why do it? You want to bluff this king? It went check check. And then you want to lose your mind when I fight. Oh, no, the five's no good anymore. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. The five's not winning often enough. It, it might win every once in a while, but it's not winning often enough. All right. So the win check check. This is out of position strategy. We bet 106 a lot. We never go all in. That's funny. But we're we're gonna bet 106. Why is our hand not in there? Because it's zero 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 one percent or something like that. Mm -hmm. So it's it's yeah, a spot that you can't say it's uh, that you did the wrong thing or not. I mean, it's just a fluke. That's, oh. uh, Where did it go? Right, falling to frequency. The seven is it leading on the turn? I'm side? pretty. I'm pretty sure it's just not happy about mm. that. Leading on the turn. Yeah. Leading on the turn. When when the draw hits. Yeah, the flush completes, and we're just like, ha ah. ha. We have. Maybe a have a draw. That's right. Okay. Yeah, we turned it into a bluff on the turn. Bluff your stack off uh, on the bubble. Good plan. <laughs> it's small. <right? laughs> Yeah, but also if the opponent is supposed to bet, so it's like we're playing with fire, but it's only matches, right? We can't really get burned here for now. So the flush completes, and we just take it, and then yeah, you have to have bluffs or not? Is it really on a seven of? Or at least you block some value hands with a five. I mean. Why is it the bingo card? Oh, nine eight. We really hit the bingo card here, right? Well, you're leading a little bit on every space. I can say yeah, that. but the the seven eight and not the seven eight and nine make more sense because they also complete the straights too. Yeah, and this in this situation, block straight. That's so why I suppose that more nines are betting than uh, five nine. But maybe it's also because you have to pay also. And bottom pair hitting, bottom pair pairing the turn, we bet more often than anything else. Yeah, we see all the but nines that no are betting pair. here. Almost all nines are betting. Okay. Look at the nines, all betting, or at least a lot of them. It feels like it's Jack. Our pair is betting a lot. And then, yeah, blocking uh, draws, huh? blocking and the X and eight X, right? Nine X and eight X. Yeah, yeah, they block the straight. And then this part here, Ace four. He it's does a flush. That's all the flush, right? Or is it? It's all flush. Yeah. That's as far as no, not all flush. That's a top pair, of course. Jack. Yeah. Go over nine five suited. Make sure that it's all of them and not just the. Uh... Oh yeah, the five of spades on the board. We don't have. Yeah. The flush in that. Yeah. And we block a set. Yeah. We block the straight. You block two pair. <laughs> if he has Jack five at least. Then. 
So let's see here. What what happens if we bet that and he calls? Do we double barrel the river? Not a lot, probably. Well, first off, you already see that this behavior here is like, what? 4x stronger at ICM, right? Yeah. So this effect is magnified by four. <clears throat> Phil is supposed to fold a lot, huh? so yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're not the only ones with ICM pressure. We can turn the pressure up on him. Yeah, yeah. So of course, that's the reason you can't do this. And he didn't bet. Uh... So yeah. And then, our... do we have the same good turns? Okay, so the five is great. And then the seven, eight, and nine of spades are in there. Just not as much as they were. Nice. So we do it a lot more, a lot more leads at ICM. Wow. Yeah, I guess that we have a lot more flush draws, flushes actually. Yeah. On this texture, let's see if it's true on other textures. Okay, so at five here, we're facing a final bet. The king, probably not good anymore with our final. Now we're folding. We can't, we don't have fold equity. Oh my goodness. Oh, he still wants to shove? I was calling. Oh, and oh. Yeah, I see the amount of uh, dollar you get, 2.5. If it can call a river bet, <laughs> why does it bluff it? I thought we were bluffing because we can't call. Well. Um, Is it because, because the, the, I, maybe the, the, the nine doesn't block anything? I don't think we call every five. Yeah, that's right. Like ace five is folding, queen five is folding. Almost hey, every fives right. are folding. Well, did we have a, one of one of these here in the slivers? So we shouldn't it's just be a here. Pause, with... I'll, uh, call on it. You're not really calling with a five here. Basically, that's the idea. So we were right. Oh, so we're calling with a five that blocks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was just like yeah, because we didn't lead when we make it there with the a hair, and then it doesn't care. Is is that one still up in the background? I wanted to see if we if we barrel off on the river, if he, we get called after we bluff the turn. Um, so it's here. Yeah, King is actually very good for his uh, calling range. Huh? King Queen, Ace Jack, Ace Queen. So you want to see what no? All right, we we bet the turn. We lead the turn. Yeah, we lead the turn. I think it's it goes small. small. He, and calls. he calls. And, and then the king. What was it? The king of clubs or king of diamonds? Diamonds. Best and let's see if you bluff your five x. You do. Yes, we double barrel. Yeah, it's small. Not all in. Small. Our idea to turn it was right because it's not good anymore. Yeah, but look at the EV of betting. So the reason why you wanted to turn it was one, it went check, check on the turn, two, it's not good anymore, right? Yeah. Let's, let's suppose we bet this and what should he go with? So we take the spot there and we bluff. Can you look what, what they should call it? So one other thing I didn't pay attention. It's always small. You're never really risking your R stack, no matter what. Hmm. Only if you have it. So he's calling no. with a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, it's also folding a whole bunch of stuff. Base five. Oh. He's folding a lot of tens. <laughs> um, better fives. He's calling a lot of okay. sevens. Ace ten, queen ten. So the only thing we 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 get there is to get better aces off, better five five x hands of our hand, of yeah. uh, of the hand. Yeah, some queen sevens. Now we get some tens off. We get some sevens off. Yeah. We yeah. get pocket queens to fold. 
Yeah. Pocket nines, pocket eights, pocket sixes. And we block uh, jack five and fives. And nine eight. Right. Decent. Yeah, we're never getting a jack off. Yeah, okay. We're, but, yeah, we're never that's... getting a jack to fold. Yeah, for that sizing, it, it's... Jack you six will probably also fold. I'll also block folding. Probably nobody will fold the jack. Yeah, but jack yeah. six is folding. Jack six, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the smallest but one. Do we, but do like we think the population folds jack six, though? But it partially say. folds, yeah. It, it doesn't fold completely. It partially folds. Yeah. So. But even look, ace jack is folding some. I mean, so we even get some jacks to fold. So oh, like that the worst blocker is the ace, right? After that is the queen. Yeah, but uh, king eight is raising us. As is uh, queen eight. Well, if we get raised, what space? If we get raised, it's an easy fold. Yeah. Yeah, but if bluff raises us, then uh, we lost. Uh... Yeah, but I don't think they bluff enough in that uh, that spot. On the bubble, yeah, the population, and also, but uh, then population. again, the population probably arrives uh, stronger at the river. Yeah, yeah, my instinct was to bluff it, so I'm I'm glad that I was right on that. Ooh, a big bet! I wanted to raise. Do I raise anyway? Uh, you too. Bad. I think. I'm a... mm. No, I think we fold to that size. Yeah. Can we fold? We have a double go, and we have a back door. Uh... Back Maybe against this large chance to just call big, big, big sizing, we're relatively short. Uh, that's true. The bubble. Like 55% in ICM is like 75% or more in chip EV. If he bet 75% here in chip EV, would you fold? Yeah. For yeah. This stack size, maybe, yes. I would rate. You're not drawing to a hand that can turn the nuts. You're drawing to a draw, and you can't yeah. you can't pay the big price for that. I have a lot of backdoor in it. So it's just a fold. Just a fold. Oh. Ace high, we overfold. Remember, it's hard to defend backdoors against ace high boards, especially if you're not deep stacked. I wanted to raise a lot. We're here to save you, Louis. Stay away from the light. Deuce of diamonds, do you raise, Joey? What hand did you say? King deuce of diamonds. No, I guess not. No. Oh. <laughs> oh, and, and you can see, like in ICM, there's just not a lot of raising here. Okay. Then let's compare. Eight, ten, three. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No turn. Eight. Okay. Oh. So is there a difference for in position? Uh, not so much. Not really. He bets small. He bets bigger. Oh my goodness. Is the top one the ICM? Yeah. So he bets larger more often. Yeah, that's the button, right? The button seems to be betting bigger every time. He has a range advantage, so uh, yeah, he can put a lot of pressure. So seems, yeah, every sim we've looked at so far, the button is sizing up at ICM. Well, in, in Chip EV, a double Broadway board, we usually do start... Um. Increasing the bets. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, no checking here, right? So we bet a lot. So 36, 36. Uh, reasonable similar. Mm -hmm. Differences, but that can also be uh, due to... Uh, there are trees uh, falling on the left side, not on the right side. That's the big difference. Also the aces. King three, queen three. But, so interesting, yeah. Our two pairs are getting more like aggressive bottom, than... bottom pair is mixing. 
right? It's of it's folding already. So the just the one bed on the flat. <clears throat> yeah, all the offshoot uh, trees are falling actually yeah, on the left side. Yeah, this is one of the spots I asked about when the when the button gets to start bedding larger with more hands. We have to start bedding it, holding the bottom pair. Yeah, you gotta mix right, and then at ICM gotta mix a lot. I think I saw the bird. He says, like in ICM, we're not allowed to glove catch. So maybe that's something to do with it that we cannot call. Like we in ChipEV, we call the lower pair. But in this spot, we cannot because we're not able to, to bluff catch because you can barrel off on the turn. Would be my approximation. I think yeah, you even fold uh, some uh, King Jack uh, off and uh, Queen Jack off. And, uh... I think that advice yeah. was more meant for river bluffs. No, it's for all uh, bluffs. I thought for uh, all, all ICM was a thought. It's also on the flop and turn. Look at uh, King Jack and uh, Queen Jack. Oh, they're already falling a bit. All right. Probably if you don't have one of the suits. Yeah. I get four. I don't know. It's four dudes. <laughs> <laughs> Just a fall. Easy fall. Yep. Would oh, you call a nine ten of diamonds here? Of course. Did you, did you actually use yeah. the same ranges? Yeah, I think so. Or not three flop. I mean, yeah, nine Would ten. You raise ten queen of diamonds. Yeah, do I oh. see? Okay, probably a nice shame you fold uh, even more. Even not going to be much raising. Even call with the clubs. Okay. King, Jack, A. King, Jack, A. Facing a small bet. Again yeah. and again, we see top pair not behaving the same. Yeah, you don't want to go broke, huh? Yeah. So your worst top pair are not uh... But look at the 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 ten fours and ten three and ten dues. <laughs> yeah, do we ever get nuts with these uh, races? I think not. It's just a bluff, isn't it? We cannot get uh, nuts by this. We just trace and if he calls, we shut down, or what? What we gonna do? Good question. Yeah. So say we raise one hundred. I think if you uh, run into backdoors, then uh, you uh, continue. Otherwise, not. Yeah, queen. Nine. Same as uh, same principle, I think, as uh, with JPV. All right. Let's put the diamonds. Yeah, I'm still betting. Oh, still betting everyone. Yeah, but that's a four. It's not here. Ten three is only diamonds. Betting. But ten five is betting. Is that? Hmm. So we see the, those that are raising okay. hundred. They pick up equity on the turn. If you turn your back door, they're going with it. You're betting small, or what? What was the size? If we can back with you. <clears throat> Probably what your range want to bet. Oh. Huh? It's a uh, four speed. You just have a uh, null in size left, basically. Oh, spicy. <laughs> All right. A pair of A. How far? Easy call. Easy call. Yeah, easy yeah. call. Yeah. I agree. Even have a spade. Okay. How far do we call? Oh my goodness. Ooh, I think we. This is bad. This is the... yeah. Already mixing thing. More fault on call. At least it's a, a big bet. Still a clean out and a five also, but uh, still yeah. a good fit. So we just muck? Yeah, yeah. I don't know what solver we're doing. next. Muck. <laughs> Make a small loss if you call. And then. Do you need to call any fives there after this double barrel? Fives? Fives? 
which you mean now? Uh, Why are we calling five? H. I mean, all the five? What, what do you mean? Uh, no, I mean eight. Eight, uh, Or like a pocket five, something like that. No, no. pocket pairs. Pocket pairs are even full anymore, I think. Yeah. I think eights might mix a bit. Oh, eights are gone. They're, they're, yeah, they're mixing a bit. Depending on what the... I'll slip on still calling. What suits are in the offsuit? What suits are calling? Uh, is he 58 a lot? It's... You ask a uh, joy for what suit? Yeah, in the offsuit, eights. Oh, wait, there's, I'm sorry, it's suited eights. Yeah, suited is spades and offsuit, what's king eight off? The spade. Also a spade, so you can bluff uh, if you uh, spade come. Oh, yeah. Especially if the king, actually. I see. Okay, Jack, maybe we can... Go. Or race with oh, the oh, set so, uh, This is the race. spot we saw, Maxi, where at GPV you always race. Oh, um, yeah. Race were very often. Jack 10-5. Yeah, I think we just don't race for thin value. Nice anymore. Same, but and then we look at this majority race here. And then here we don't race at all. Mm -hmm. This is the but difference. All. Oh, now that we hit two pair, what are we going to do? Oh, he checks back. Wait, sure. Go back. Do we have any leads on the seven of diamonds? Uh, Was it complete to straight? We do. Yeah, some, but... Uh, oh, but, uh, actually... Okay. 50%. Seven is always a great card oh. for the big blind, right? Yeah. It completes the straight. All right, let's have a look. On the turns, he wrote checks. But the seven is so amazing. Okay, not that good this time. But if it was a spade, we would go wild. Yeah, That's but still 32% uh, right? leading. Yeah. That's a lot. That's a lot in the set. And with Jack Seven, that's a hand you want to lead. Yeah, at least uh, two thirds or something like that. And then look at the difference. GPV, the seven, you're just like, yeah, okay. Six <clears throat> percent betting. Yeah. Here, thirty-two percent. It's just like, oh, it's a seven. Yeah, yeah that, that's, that's the thing. Yeah, you, you fold more, so you have a stronger range if uh, a draw yeah. it. Yeah, and there's more donking in um, ICM than there is Chippy V. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, you also don't want him to polarize turn a lot. Right? Our hand does want him to polarize turn, but... So most of your jacks are betting. On the turn. They're not raising the flop, but they're bet check call, bet turn, lead turn. This is so annoying. Yeah, but that's uh some you become dumb I say yeah. to annoy people. All right. So we should have been leading a lot on the seven. Now, the six. So we went check, check now, right? Yes. Yeah, we bet, but I don't know how large. 86. I think that's not. A... No, Bring no, no check. Maybe. Yeah. Is this Bring too it. greedy? Yeah. Okay. When we get oh. raised, we're fucked. In my sense. And we fold. It's okay. better to check call with okay. our two pair. I don't mm, check calling our two pair. No. I like a big bet. Too. Not after check check. I don't want to lose the value. minimum. Yeah, I, f I feel like in Chippy V we could go 86, but in ICM I always like bring my down bet down like one sizing. All right. Let's explore the Chippy V sim. 
Six of diamonds. Oh my goodness, the big bad sizes. Look at that. Jack seven here is just stuffing. Ripping. Stuffing all in? You mean? Yeah. What? Yeah, be, yeah. oh, yeah. But this is without ICN. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. But with and with ICM? So 86 might be when we look at that, 86 might be good. Oh. All right, all right. Let's try. 86, no good. No, we're still at 58. I should have stuck with it. No, it's, oh, no, 106. It's 106. Even bigger. Hmm. Bigger or very small. Ooh. Yeah, small to induce a three bet, maybe. Yeah, I also to protect that range you need against the uh, rest. Yeah, also, yeah. Mm -hmm. And you can bet a 10 also. Uh, but... Okay, so the basically the, the only... answer was 106, right? 86 was the only yeah, answer. Yeah, but look, look at the difference. EV <laughs> no difference. frequency. <laughs> are no EV differences uh, between the bets. So. Yeah. And also, look, we never checked. Yeah. So I don't mind. Uh, yeah, six. because I checked the chart, so we don't check. All right. Yeah, we're out. Yeah, you should check fault. Do you call if you have like the nine of spades? Only the nine of spades? No. No, right? I wouldn't, at least. Someone said that the back doors uh, are folding or. Uh, I, 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 think we have I added this board myself. Lead? We have some leads here. I don't think it. I don't think we do it with this hand, no. Well, we have a draw, and overcut. And if then, if you lead and a jack comes, then probably our jack is good. Otherwise, it's uh, just rubbish. Yeah, but we have the dummy end of a. We would need a four liner to hit the straight, and we have the dummy end. Yeah. I don't think that's too good of a draw. It's pretty bad, but if we think about it, everything seems to be magnified here. So we, yeah. our leading range is probably magnified here. Maybe? You, it, okay. If you want to lead here, you want to have a spade blocking his continues. You don't want to lead small unblocking his continues here. Yeah, that was going to be my question. Do we or do we not want to spade? Yeah. Jack, Jack yeah. of spades. I would want to spade here uh, with my bluffs. Or, Jack or an eight or nine. Lead all the time. Yeah, I think, I think an Jack eight or nine spades. would lead. Spades. Yeah. Obviously, sevens would. Maybe so some. You guys don't want to lead here because we don't have a spade. I would lead anyway. Yeah, I think checking. Uh, I probably not right. Oh, uh, we're leading now. Hmm? Did we lead or not? Not no lead. Oh. No. No lead in range. See if it leads with the jack of spades. Yeah. Jack of spade only. You guys were right. We made a spade. Yeah, and jack of spades, three of hearts. Loves it. So. And jack of hearts, three of spades, also raising a bit. So you really, yeah. really want to, it's, you really want to block his continues, and that's the reason, eh? But yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. Because... Bluffing, yeah. So blocking continues is also. Always... I don't know if you guys see here, but we're mostly leading. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I knew that would be the situation, just not with our combo. All the eights, all the nines, all the single spades. <laughs> Ooh. Not all the single spades, huh? All single. Uh... Of card space, probably. A very different strategy here. GP yeah, but you know, we we just ball. lead Jan. Did you know that? The frequency of leading is identical, though, pretty much. Yeah. But the size is very different. You see the motion here, basically. You don't use big size when you lead at all. You just bet small. Yeah, but yeah. Getting small is all already putting a lot of pressure. Okay, one well, check. Player pool doesn't know. The five pair is pretty good for us, no? 
Die bent ik. Dan de Rift of Five a lot. Dan uh, het snap je. In Chip and V, I would go 66. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would be too. a hand to check back a lot here. So I would probably go 54. Uh, yeah. I might even go 36. I mean. It's a uh, ICM, eh? so. Yeah, I would go yeah. 36 uh -huh. myself as well. <laughs> so 36, you're just pricing in too many draws? It checks 100%. He's supposed to fold a lot of draws. Eh? So. Not supposed to lead. King, King High. Yeah. Better checks. Like if you look at the EV, the bigger you lead, the more EV you lose. And then it's probably a thing like uh, it's just our hand, right? Yeah. Because yeah. I think the range is going to do it. Yeah. You don't block anything except if you're three, four, three, you have block. Still need a spade. Uh, yeah, now space is rational. And, and, and Louis is right. There's no big bets here. Yeah. Yeah, lots of spades, lots of hearts. So we call one? Yeah, we call it. Please. Yeah. Do you call it reduce full frequency? <laughs> No, yeah, maybe. Deuce, maybe you fold not you fold all the deuces that are a club, not full frequency, but there are all the deuces are in there at some frequency. I think, I think if it was king 10, we might mix, but this dry, we call every deuce full frequency. That's my guess. Yeah, I, I wouldn't be It'd surprised. Be small be yeah, we're still gonna overfold on king boards, so I think it's gonna fold some deuce of clubs combos. It like nine deuce of clubs. Nope. Nope. Call Never them all. Yeah. And I would definitely be a little too tight here. See, yeah. I, I would do, I would do the same. I probably also fold. Yeah, the king, king know, ten five sure. would be folding some fives. I think I'm just too tight pre flop here. Only yeah, but these are not. Uh, I think it's not TP range. They're not our team ranges, so we, I'm, uh, am I correct? I'm sorry. Yes. The preflop ranges are from the chippy V, and not from the ICM. That's correct because we want to see the one for one effect. Yeah. On the range. I see. Okay, that makes more sense. Yeah. Louis on the King Ten. I think if we go back one node, we'll find out that the button shouldn't be betting small very often on that board. Uh, only small? Still does. I see him. That's also what uh, Giraffe says a lot. Eh? We can just bet small, small, and then uh, decide on the river how big we want to go. Yeah. So we call a six. A deuce pair. Do we do something? We have a yes, six. yes, we're going to have hands that do something. But is middle pair the hand you want to do turn into a glove? Yeah, you want and to I'm, you protect now we still have, uh, I would bet small. Now we still have a pair, so we don't have to, to bluff. So this is good, just a, strong enough, I think. I don't think we're leading necessarily as a bluff, but it would be more like a protection like a block bet type. Do we lead with the six? Or yeah, I would lead. Of protection, yeah. protection, yeah. He's supposed to bet that uh, flop, uh, I think, a lot or not. Uh, yeah. So his range is, should be probably pretty weak, so I would bet. He did bet. Um, oh, he did bet. Yes. Yeah, okay, then I'll probably check. Yeah, yeah stop betting. On the turn. Blocking small? Yeah, betting small, yeah. On the river, I mean. River is going to check back. It mixes the sixes. <clears throat> but it is it is turning some of them into leads. 
Yeah, especially the low ones, actually. Six five, six four, six three. So yeah. we're supposed to be betting eighty percent of the range. Yeah. If well, the six, six pairs did the same thing. No, it's really the dudes. Yeah, it's yeah, but that's pairing the board. Huh? The six is less, maybe indeed, but uh... also especially the dudes of clubs breaking all the back doors. Yeah, we see the same thing on the six of clubs. Yeah. It clubs bets more than the other sixes. Turn, because you break the back doors. So when the back doors break and the small card pair. I think, uh, yeah, you just pair both as also and then it breaks. Yeah. Okay. So when check, check on the turn, do we bet with the six now? Yeah, small. Yeah, that's yeah, small. Twenty nine. I want a uh, a call from an ace. Yeah. I don't know about betting here. I would. Yeah. Yeah, it's checking. Do we bet any six here? I don't think so. That that throws me. We bet it on the turn, but not the river. After it goes check check. Yeah. Yeah, we are actually not protecting it because the deuce pairs, right? So we're just bluffing a lot. Yeah, we can bet a lot, so we can also bet the six then because yeah, he's not uh, supposed to have uh... not betting any sixes. Okay. Oh, monotone. Maybe you are bluff catching with sixes then. That's the reason, maybe. So, a lot of questions here. The seven. We don't lead on a seven. Yeah, now you can fold. Do you call the tree of fate? If you have it somehow. <laughs> No, oh. I wouldn't. Not the nice emerald. I like, see so you have ace with the, the tree of spade. An ace is the tree of spade. So also a five can be good and an ace. Yeah. Or a side. Yeah. Then it's call probably. Then I would call. You don't have an ace with three of the. You don't have the offshoot ace. <laughs> yeah. Ace five then. <laughs> king with three spades, yo. Oh, you even raise, man. Raising. Ooh. Yeah, but that's the king of spades, huh? Eh? King of spades, mostly. Yeah. A pair and a. Oh, it's not even a pair. Oh wait, this is. This is still on the turn. Yeah. Yep. Was the uh, H5 off doing? Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Doesn't matter. I don't think it's raising. Yeah, some, but uh, it's also the ace, the spade is raising. Yeah, it is. It's a double gutter, actually, the five. Oh, we have a heart. Oh, cool. Okay, and then yeah, what do you do with pocket six with the six of heart? Well, well, I prefer to have this. No, seven five. I would prefer, but not. Uh... Well, yeah. If the flush completes on the turn, like say the seven of heart comes on the turn, do we lead a lot with rings? Yes. Do we call here? I don't know. Chippy V, I, I wouldn't fold this, but I'm not sure. Chippy V, I would fold this also. Because the stacks are not deep enough. Okay. So as soon as the flush completes, we can lead small with a whole bunch of stuff. Especially... 
<laughs> I read a little lot more in my CM on the turn than cheaper be in all scenarios. Yeah. Definitely. Seems to be leading turns a lot more, right? Yeah, but you must then also fold the flop uh, more. Yeah. Otherwise, you can't lead. <laughs> okay. What a shitty hand. I have to call, but. Uh... Four. Do we lead on a five? Yeah, we do. Yeah. Have if we had a spade, maybe, but uh, I don't think now. You think? With the queen of spades and a douche, yes, I would lead, maybe, but. Uh... No. Let's see. At least we then we can bluff on a spade, but uh, now. Uh, and we saw some leads with nice. middle pair. Why not yeah. bottom pair? So a little straight card comes, you can lead a little bit. Yeah, don't lead the queen dudes off. But notice in this one, we're we're checking all of our second pairs too. The other one, we were betting it a lot. Yeah, we don't have as many bluffs here, so we don't have as many value bets. You mean we don't have as many value bets, so we don't have yeah. as many bluffs? Okay. <clears throat> yeah, if the board pairs, the board's better for us. And now it's, uh, yeah. well, that day we uh, get our value from it. I think we fold now. Okay, so yeah. we fold, but say we have a hand like King Seven. In game, I fold King Seven, I guess, against. On the bubble. Population. Yeah, I guess population depends on the ability. Are you supposed to fold? I think King 4 and King 3 are better. Yeah, I agree. Because they block the straights. Oh, yeah, we got and they can uh, turn on that hand. Yeah. Or river in that hand. I mean. So we see the back blockers here. And uh, eight and nine, a uh, ten a little bit. I think seven off is calling mostly, but uh, yeah, it's, but it's getting more. It's pure when it's king five and lower. Yeah, four is better of this, because of the straight interaction too. Mm hmm. Yeah, what about the river? If we call with the, our kings and he still bets the river, how are we calling the same four. amount of the kings? A king seven? Yeah, for example, king with the lower kittles. What is the river card? Mm, the brick. We didn't make what it. Is a brick on this board? Mm. Yeah, what's a brick? Yeah, no, it's. Not that easy, yeah. For instance, I would say a deuce is a brick actually. But, uh, three, a three is not a brick because then, no, uh, yeah, with the five and three, three gives you, a three is the opposite of a brick, it get, puts a four liner on the board. I would say a deuce, is a brick. I think a king, Jack, ten. Ten. a yeah. nine or a ten, yeah, uh, yeah nine is seven, eight, oh, ten. Ten. Yeah. ten, yeah, ten, so it's ten, Jack, maybe a deuce. Okay. Okay, let's try with ten. Just curious. I think a douche is also pretty breaking. Oh, you are supposed to fold some top pairs to that way. <laughs> yeah, right. You see, see that they are. Uh, uh, I call it indifferent. Yeah. Unless you have better than uh, King Jack or better. Yeah, You're yeah. calling more with the offsuit sixes than the kings. Yeah, it's set. Huh? Oh, you mean an offsuit six? Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, blocking is set. 
don't know. Yeah, but, but the Kingy blog also has set of kings, so yeah, I don't know. Yeah, but he's maybe supposed to have in this line more sixes. I mean, yeah. He blocks yeah. five. That's strange. Strange, yeah. But sometimes it's just uh, it's a V also. It's just a blocker type of thing that uh, no one can reproduce. So if it's in, in the solar, it's different than in the real life. Definitely fold. But you can't fold all your kings, right? Yeah, unless yeah, you, you know he's a maniac, you fold. <laughs> okay, we're going to call a six. A four comes. So we can lead him? Yeah, we not can lead a lot. Can not we? If it's like, based on the previous examples, we'll lead a lot. On this so one. we could four. probably lead, but... There we're, wasn't we're a lot good. of leading. It was not a lot of leading. Eh? Only if the board pairs, you can lead a lot. A low straight card as well, we could think. Yeah, you can lead, but not a lot. Because the only we only had well, we have all the three fives, so yeah, but you also have a lot of other cards. But what allows us to lead here? So it's having a five here, or mm -hmm. a seven. Please blocking straights. Check, or Check three. three blocking continuations. Three a five a seven. Three, or five, seven. Oh, it makes sense. So we have Jack six. We can do it, but Jack uh, seven. Probably a heart or something. Maybe it's hard to only, yeah, or mostly hard. I don't know. We wouldn't be here with Jack seven. That's the thing, right? <laughs> All right. So check. <laughs> do we call a second barrel? Uh, no hearts. This... Very, very small. I think this turn, I think, yes. I would fall. In reality, it doesn't have any force in his range. Oh, I'm too nitty. But it's close. Oh, even on the bubble, you call. But it's too small, right? And then the four comes. Are we going to bet fall? Uh... Yeah, no, yeah. no, the four. He never falls a king against this. But... I we don't have a four, in Louis. Yeah, it's not a, yeah. a four. Uh... Yeah, What's say. different yeah. here is that we have no fours. So we don't six. have that many fours mm -hmm. on the flop. Plus, you don't have to turn your six into a bluff. It. Okay. I think if the two paired. We might get it's, it's, it's a decent bluff because we have a we have a four king four or five four probably with some backdoor flushes. Yeah, but that's not a lot. No, but I mean we have some fours, but we don't have to turn it into a bluff anyhow because we have a six. The four pairing is not. We're not leading king four leads. That's it. I think if the two pairs something that was on that we'd still be in the hand on the flop. Yeah, uh, it may it might we might have a little bit more leading. Not really. Not really. Not. Just it's six pairs. A little bit more, but well, you have more sixes than deuces, huh? Yeah, I think maybe the river river pairing is not as valuable as the turn pairing. Yeah, you can look at the six. It's uh, six. ah, that works. We have more sixes than deuces, man. Right? Mm -hmm. Oh la and eight here. With the back door, we got a call, right? Yeah, for sure. Not folding. No, not folding. Do, no. do we have any hmm? races on this one? Yeah, we must. Do we? What exact uh, set? Maybe or not. In general, you know, if you have like Queen Jack. What do you do if you do you have ace jack here? Is king is queen? Ace king, you want to cry? You don't have ace king because you put it in his face before that. Yeah, that's true. But ace jack. Jack please. I don't think we have many ace jacks in range either, though. There's laptop equity, right? 
Yeah. And it could change. So we probably just call it a lot, right? Am I wrong? No, I don't think you're wrong. Want to peek at the GPV just to... Jack. I wonder if you're gonna. I wonder if you're gonna raise Queen Jack more than Ace Jack here, having the straight blocker being more important. All right. I mean, with the spades, we don't have Ace Jack in range that much, though. So. Yeah, we don't. Well, not in Chippy V at all. But I would still three bet or shove Ace Jack pre flop. Right, so yeah, King see. Jack or Queen Jack here wants to raise. Sizing up with the Queen Jack and and then okay, so as I kind of figure it out a little bit we don't do much raising unless we locked it we have it right look how much it's folding it's calling eight two more than nine two what's going on there have a good shot or for nine's, a pair. nine's a pair no you have an open end the ribbon eight well bottom pair doesn't seem to be as valuable on locked up equity board same it looks weird it's like for me, no. The nine five to nine two, it's probably only spades. Also in ICM world, you want that has that's to be diamonds. Body, yeah. Diamonds. So your draw has more EV than the what's the EV of the nines? Barely anything. Look how much more an eight is. Well, it's not that much more. The other spades is a ton. Yeah, there's eight of eight uh, spades, of course, in, the, in there. So what so we raise what? Ten percent less. We fall about the same frequency, right? But instead of raising, we call. Okay, and then a queen four of hearts here could be raising. Ah, I don't have much queen four of hearts here. What about you guys? It's a queen, right? But I don't know. Okay, so eights are what? Calling? Yeah. Or raising. Mm, that's a horrible card and a good card at the same time. Is it good? Is it bad? Who knows? Well, we now have a we have a flush draw and since the ace of diamonds is out and that okay. reduces a lot of his potential flush draws. Because most of his flush draws would have been the suited aces with diamonds. Feels like it's still a call. All right? Yeah. That'd be race sometimes. Oh my goodness. I didn't think we were going to go for it. <clears throat> yeah, you might race sometimes. It, yeah. It's shoving? It's shoving every time on the turn. It's an ace. He's not going to fold a pair. I thought an ace was too good for his range that we yeah. don't get. To. Yeah, but he, he bet uh, the flopper. So, how many aces does he have? When he bets the flop. Got ace jack, ace ten, ace nine, ace queen. Yeah, but does he have ace four, ace king? Ace, ace, uh, ace, 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 ace four, ace three, ace deuce. Uh yeah, probably with spades or diamonds. Yeah, but the, the, the diamond ace, ace is there, so he doesn't have that anymore. Right. So the weak spades probably bet. Maybe not. They might yeah, but that, that's not a lot, huh? No, but it's and uh, does he now bet the turn with uh spades? I think we're just jamming because we have so much equity, yeah. But also, maybe the uh, yeah, I don't know how many. Uh, well, 
Let and you're gonna get us. You're gonna get pairs to fall. He's gonna fold like let's, worse pairs than an ace. Let's look at his. Yeah, that's what I mean. Range. And then it's how many aces does he have? Is the question. Okay, so it's a low frequency play, right? Uh, can you see what the the, the other player is doing uh, with his ace? Can we do that on the turn? And we check what does he do with his aces? No, that's us. He's range I think that turn. Uh, can you make the weights proportional? No, he's got a ton of aces. Yeah. Uh, so he's range betting almost. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, the aces. The ace is the greatest card to bluff. Yeah, he doesn't have a ton of ace eh, because a six to ace deuce is probably jamming a uh, pre flop. Yeah, that's, that's, just that, that's the suited. Three, the three yeah. play card board is just really good for him, right? Do we open shop? He doesn't uh, have. That. No. We bet 54, I think. Yeah, that seems reasonable. Yeah, we can't shove because I see him, right? But I can't call her almost be the perfect amount. Anything. Eight six. Woo! What are we gonna do, Carl? Oh, uh, PP, I would like to race, but uh, not my CM. Yeah, <laughs> I was also. <laughs> but the fake we have to just. I, I only played cash game uh, on the big blind deep, so I race. <laughs> not now. <laughs> not now. You want to raise more with the heart in your hand or without? Do you raise yes. more at ICM or at JPV? More with the heart, you raise. I think. Yeah. And uh, in, in ICM, yeah, we want to raise less. Bets, that, that's, that's awful, huh? At this spot. Yeah. So it okay. six off here. You need a heart at JPV. And it's raising with the heart kind of frequently. Here. And you face less jams. <laughs> okay. So say it's raising at GPV. The effect is going to be magnified. So it's going to be raising even more. We couldn't, we couldn't say it, but uh, what? how often is he better for hard to fall on this flop? Not, not so often. Yeah. So I thought. Okay, so I say we can check raise more. You that, don't have a heart. That was a mistake. Yeah. I mean, you just looked at the solution. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. Maybe maybe against population, it's okay. It's, six. it's oh. raising a lot. You need a heart. You need a heart. Yeah. Look at this. It's not raising anymore. Look at the raising range of the dumpster. Boom. Uh, what if he raises the right size, 36 or 2, whatever it was? What do you mean? What if he bats the right size? Let's see. Or then you have to raise even less. He was betting the right size. Oh, ICM? This is the ICM? Yeah. yeah. Okay. We'll say he is polar. Yeah, it's just sorry. Still just call. And raise half half as often. It makes sense. Even less. Yeah, it's about well, you bet twice as much, so you bet you raise twice as less. Chippy V, you got jams, huh? Yeah. Yeah, that's well, yeah. You're only twenty big balance deeper, so you have jams. And then look at the hand like Jack Seven on TPV. First of all, at ICN, 
not so much. Strong hands, ICM, you just play. I want to get paid now. Yeah. Let's lock it up, back it up before the ace comes. I don't want him to have any opportunity to out. He raised. That was not good. Now he jams. What are we going to do? Are we going to back down? Yeah, fold. We just we got eight outs, right? Fold. You, you turned your hand into a bluff. It's time to fold. Mm. Back off your backs. Yeah, calling was punting here. <laughs> so yeah, you're gonna have some combo draws like the straight flush that's gonna have to get it in. So yeah, but even then, probably you don't uh, raise uh, as much uh, with ICM than without ICM. Easy. For sure, you don't. Yeah, just fold it. Right? Fold. Okay. Check fold. So, Chippy V, you probably can't fold that. This, yeah, to a small bet, yeah. This is what I call here at Tippy V. Yeah. Think so? No, I don't think so. I don't think I would make that. But... Maybe with the eight of hearts, but uh, not with uh, the club. Holding. Okay, a low pair board. Can we lead here? Uh, do we lead a lot from the pair board? I don't. We have a cutter. Uh, we have we don't have uh, pairs, eh, so we don't have sets. We have uh, the five, of course, but he's got a decent amount of fives too, right? And sevens, so yeah. and sevens, and seven, seven, and eight, eight, and nine, nine, and ten, ten. I still want to check raise. If you don't, oh, I would. I want check call. So more check races than actual dons. Uh, oh, like uh, okay, yeah. Oh, look at that. Seventy-seven percent donkey. Hmm. Strange. We can hit the six for for the straight. We have not advantage. Look at that. Uh, you have two off cards to the seven uh, and a good shot, so you could say. So yeah. 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 Plus another advantage. We have more fives, I think. Yeah, well, it's raising fifty. It's leading fifty-seven percent of the range, roughly. So <laughs> it's not just that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if you can lead range a lot, then this is one of the candidates need. Yeah, I can understand that. So the five, right? Yeah, but this is eight, nine eight with a heart, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's nine eight with a club doing? Same. Yeah, same. That's not the do this in Chippy V as well. Uh, uh, I don't think it's. I, I wouldn't be a sure. A little bit, a little bit, but a lot less. You raised big. Chippy V, it's going big. Unless. Unless. Yeah, ICM. Yeah, ICM. You can bet smaller and uh, get false, huh? And then more, uh, more often. Okay. So everything is magnified, and the sizings are down. Yeah, because small sizing is uh, putting a lot of pressure. Over. But sizings are up for the button. So mm. everything is magnified, basically. Here. Like Chippy V, I think the button is betting small, 60%. Here, say we check, the button is betting only 40%. It's still magnified just here. He just wants to check a lot more than bet. It's yeah. still magnified. Yeah. Different. The check effect. Yeah, you have to define what magnified is. Huh? Otherwise, you can say yeah, it's magnified. A 10, we lead on a 10, not really, right? 
Man, if Dubba Cup or not. With the diamond, maybe the nine of diamonds, maybe. Ken, check, check. We get a got or do we bet? Like okay. I said, if I had the diamond in my hand, maybe so I could try to, but I don't even know if I, I guess I would have to keep bluffing diamonds if I had a diamond in my hand. It's not the best combo, but yeah, like I think you got to go for it sometimes. I would go small. So you we got fives in our range. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Oh, you can even go without diamonds. Yep. Yeah, I guess because we just have way more fives now when they check. Have an open hand there. Okay, so now we check. He bets. Do we call? Do we raise? You have the odds to call, so I would probably just call. Just call, you say? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. His bet was small, so we I check. Yay! A church. Hmm. Another seven five five. Old. <laughs> What do you do, Ken, with King Six of Hearts? On the bubble. Raise. Donk lead. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. We just saw it. 80% of the range. <laughs> I come in and lead. <laughs> so, can we check raise with the King Six of Hearts? Clubs only. It really only leads and it doesn't care at all. So you don't have King Six of Hearts anymore because we lead. <laughs> Joe is right, just don't lead with it. So we fold this one? Yeah. It's a big lead, so I fold. I would have folded anyway, even though it's a small bit. Yeah, probably not. So this is going to have oh, to do six, something. Six. Straight draws and a good shot. What do you think it does? I think it would either check, raise, or call. I don't know the difference between the ICM and the whatever, but it's going to do something. Now we're leading. Well, with this hand? Yeah. Yeah. I'm not yeah. leading. I would lead if I had space. Why this hand? We, we have, have, that not, we have, we have a lot of leads. So that I agree, but uh, do we, we have a good card to bluff and we only have 10 high? We lack the twos. We don't have six two. We don't have twos much. We have some king two, I guess. We have some kings, but like, I would do. I would lead with space <clears throat> and fold these. I'm leading. Just don't know the size. Let's go small. Oh, it was thirty six. Or check. Or check. Not checking actually. You, you can't uh, bluff. Uh, you can't say I don't have anything, so I uh, I bluff. I mean that's well. The sober then, then you over bluff in this spot. The sober was doing it thirty percent of the time. Yeah, but that's not a lot. Is it doing with the back door with the space? It's a decent amount, but if you do it always, then you over bluff, of course. No, I'm not saying major front door. Yeah, okay. You have to recognize the hands where you do have potential bluffs. And then it's an opponent dependent. Do I bluff this opponent? Bluff them all like dogs sort them out. Now, the six game. Which one is the best, the deuce or the six? The six is bad because now he has. Uh... I'm bluffing now. Eighty six, right? Mm -hmm. Bet the six on the turn. That's the question. Actually. Now we can play the board, and we only lose to eight. How about one o six? Did we bluff with the six on the, or bet with the six on the flop? It's just ninety six yeah. in the box. I would check our half half pot. 
<laughs> we if we check, we beat all of his non-pair hands. What does he, I don't think he has too many non-paired hands though. All I'm gonna say is if we bet here, I think it's gonna be big. I'm with Ken here. I just don't know between 86 or 106. He says I'm, 106. I'm I toward think. between 106 and 174. I mean, yeah, our hand is play It's board. ICM, Ken. You can't punt it off. All right? So that's Watch off me. the limit. Watch Watch me. <laughs> that's an ICM punt. Huh? Yeah. KPV is uh, probably okay. but uh, Get extra points for that. It's going to be <laughs> the 106 <laughs> or 86 at best. It was punt at that point. <laughs> I say 86. Yeah, I think so. Uh, no. Ken was right. It's only. No, it's 106. Only 106. Why do you pick 106, Ken? Well, because, like, I don't know if this is right or not, but I just feel like the way this played out, we just have way, 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 way more six exit range. Check, check. Bet call. Uh, not if you bet 10 7 on the term every time. <laughs> Let's see how many sixes they have in their range compared to us. That's the best way to do it. Well, it's not, it's not even that. Our hand has no value. But what I would say, well, the... you have to have value to bluff. So you got to find your value first. If you have, yeah. The not a big nut advantage here, then you go, you get to uh, over bet. Now we have the offsuit sixes, right? Look at all the offsuit sixes we have. But one thing I would say, Ken, is that I'm finding this to be fairly true. Is that whatever your instinct for Chippy V says to do, bring it down one notch. In sizing for the most so part. how I come to this conclusion is I play I did some toy game work and uh I think I'm starting to get a grasp of it and this is part of it. Yeah, the, the difference for not that big I mean, uh, and it's only 20 uh big ones or big not big ones. It's only a small difference. So if we were deeper, you'd still have over beds here. Oh interesting. Just because we have more sixes. Yeah. It's on board. Okay. Just an easy fold. On the fold. Yeah. Do you call it a nine six of clubs here? Yeah. Yeah, it's a good shot. I would imagine. Call that one. Should we go to? I wouldn't call clubs just because I'm a little tight. It probably does call it's them all. But... Straight draw. Three it's, it's, it's a it's a gut shot to me. It's a gut shot. But yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. It's a draw to a nut hand. That's the reason I would call. At least not fault. Big difference in the raising range. JPV will want to raise a lot, like 20%, 22% of the time. And here it's only 7%. Bottom pair. The... Oh, LP, uh, can oh. you go back to the hand with the sixes? Did we have block bets too? But not with that, not with our combo, but like, does the range have block bets? It didn't, right? Now that I think about it, it only had the one big bet size. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no, there's some small bets here. Where are these kings? Okay, so it does have block bets. 
Yeah, the weaker kings. That's it. So that's like another aspect that um, when you have a real small bet, uh, you also have really big bets. You have two buckets. Mm. You don't usually have much in the middle. You zoom past it, but I think we get slivers of leads on top pair pairing too. And you almost always have slivers of leads, huh? You got to fold here, right? Yeah. Or call. No, I don't think I'm folding here. You want to call? What? Not? Okay. <laughs> Majority fold, though. Yeah. Giving you the double dribbler, well. Oh, oh well. Here comes a pop. Fold. Fold. Do you call a pair of three here? When you're mixing? Yep. No, I think with the ace 10, we can start folding some threes. Yep. Big bet, ace and ten. You're right. I was big bet in it, okay. Oh, a little five. Oh, oh look no, no, no. at this. Uh, oh, the green man, and still we have to fold. Okay. Even if we knew that, probably we have to fold. If we remember correctly, having a nice here is bad if you want a hero call, right? Well, say we want to hero this guy right on the bubble. What do we need? Five two of hearts. No. I don't know about that, Pete. I think no five can call unless you have two pair. I think. I don't think that ten can call. No ten. Ten X, ten X suited with spades. Yeah. Would you rather have Jack seven here, or Queen Jack? Queen uh, Jack. That's close because King Queen is of course bluff candidate. And if King Jack we block that. Jack seven, I think. But I I Jack uh, I would prefer Jack eight or something like that. Not Jack nine. Jack seven. Okay. Yeah, some, not the Queen Jack, but I think Jack Nine, Jack Eight make better. Why well, Queen Jack is that well like hair down? Because it blocks King Queen, Queen Jack, uh, like uh, the upper combo. I don't know, I that Queen Jack is uh, pushing it, but I don't think so. Yeah, I still have Queen Jack is going. Queen Jack is good enough. But is that hearts only, or because you have a full? Uh, that's hearts and clips on you. Diamonds too. Yeah, everyone. Uh, at least Jack Nine is calling some. <laughs> Two pair. Spades. Yeah, we can't pull two pair. Just queen five and ace five call. Because we have no sets. Two pairs the top of our range. Hmm. Green five off. Yeah, it has to be a queen of hearts, I guess. Queen of spades? No, or or queen, queen of hearts. I don't I'm know. Sorry, queen of spades. Queen of spades. All right, very interesting. Nice little session, everybody. Thanks a lot.